Hey YouTubers, this is Austin Allen here, and today and today I will be reviewing the NECA King Kong figure made by NECA. I bought this giant gorilla figure from Target and it cost $29.99 and it's made and it's made by NECA. Famous for making alien figures, predator figures, Godzilla figures, gargoyle figures, and the teenage mutants and the ninja turtle figures. For the packaging of the box, is it's got a, a cool artwork of the King Kong figure roaring and it says King Kong on it. And on the side of the box is a angry King Kong roaring at you with the name King Kong Real Toys and NECA logos. And on the back of the box is the King Kong figure in a different variety of variety of poses. And on the other side of the box it's got a an King, it's got King Kong with a different head, different facial, different face expression, and two gripping hands, two open hands. It has a plastic window inside with a Velcro flap. See? It has a Velcro inside. It has a plastic window with the figure. You can see the King Kong figure inside. And on, it has a, it has a, and it has a picture of the King Kong figure right there. And I'll, and let's crack this monkey out of the box and see how cool he actually is. Ladies and gentlemen, look at Kong, the eighth wonder of the world, in his kingly glory, in his kingly glory, and all his kingly glory. He has an interchangeable head and hands. See for his accessories. Now this figure measures about this figure is about eight inches tall from the top of the conical head from the top of its conical head and the film King Kong and, and, and the 1933 film King Kong King Kong was said to be 18 feet tall here on Skull Island and 24 feet tall in New York City Look at this. Kong has a weird expression. Kong has a classic 1933 head. Sculpted by Marcel Delgado and animated by stop motion master himself, Willis O'Brien. He has a classic King Kong. He has a classic King Kong style. He has a classic 1933 King Kong style head. His eyes are look 
His eyes are pink with orange, orange brown irises, and the pupils are round and black. His nostrils are flared out. Look at the teeth and the gums, and the tongue, look, and the tongue as well as the as well as the roof of the mouth, looking all wet inside. His teeth are kind of off white and yellow. He never brushed his teeth. Prominent canine teeth from top to bottom. His tongue is pink inside. The roof of the mouth is red, looking all wet inside. He has a heavy brow, sculpted ears on both sides. Sculpted hair all over the body, closed fist. He has a gray face and a gray chest and gray and gray. Closed fist and gray feet. Textured, sculpted hair is textured as well as the battle scars. This version, this NECA version of King Kong is, ba is, very, is loosely based on the 1933 King Kong but with, but with a twist. It has the... His hair is all... Kong's hair is all... King Kong's hair is all... Has different shades of brown, orange... Different shades of brown, such as, such as orange brown hair... And light brown hair, light and dark brown hair all over the body, reminiscent of the MonsterVerse King Kong, but it has the freshly red cut battle scars on the chest and on the face as well, reminiscent of the Peter Jackson King Kong. Remin reminiscent of the Peter Jackson King Kong. And what's that? With a little drip of blood on the fur. He has 19 million hairs all, all over his body. Except except for the che except except for the face, chest. Except except for the face, hair. Except except for the face, chest, palm palms and hands and hands and feet. His, he, his head can turn left and left and right. You can look up and down straight straight at you, straight at you. Kong's Kong's has a Kong has a confused look on his face. See? He has double jointed elbows like this. Double jointed elbows on both sides, and an, an articulated torso. Fully articulated, fully articulated torso, with a dab crunch. Ratchet joints. Articulated shoulders, arms, and shoulders. Rat, ratchet joints. Articulated wrist. He could do splits. You can hear a ratchet joint in both legs. He could do splits. Articulated legs. Double jointed knees. You can hear a loose you can hear a ratchet joint inside the leg. 
inside each inside each leg, double jointed knees on both sides. See, ankle pivot, ankle rocker pivot, articulated ankles, ankle rocker movement. You can pivot side to side, just like the, just like that. Ankle rocker movement. <laughs> and the back, and on the back, he has sculpted butt fur from behind. Nicely dry, nicely dry brushed, orange brown hair, light brown and dark brown, different tones of brown, brown to brown tones. Dry brushing, brown tones on the back. Dry brushing, reddish brown and orange brown, orangish, orange brown and red, reddish brown. And different shades of brown, brownish tones all over the body. See? He has nipples on his chest. And now for some articulation, and now for some accessories. And now for some, and now for some accessories. We can pop off the. We can pop off the classic 1933 Kung head off, and replace it with a. He has a, his head's on a double ball peg or a single ball peg, maybe a double ball peg. See. His head's on a double ball jointed, double ball jointed head. See? See? <sighs> His head's on a double ball peg, a double ball jointed head. See? Let's get that head on right about now. And here we have Kong, King Kong with, a, with an angry expression, an angry roaring expression. Uh, with the angry head on. And here we have King Kong with a with, a, with an angry roaring with an angry roaring head on. Yeah. The teeth of the gums jutting out. With all the canine teeth and the gums jutting out from, from his mouth. The tongue is speckly. This is a modern type King Kong head. He can beat his chest just like that. He can beat his chest just like that. Just like that. And now let's pop these hands off. Let's pop these closed fists off and get them in a grabbing pose. Whoops. And here we have King Kong with with two with two open hands and here and here we have King Kong with two open hands I'm about to re reach out and grab you just like that Nicely, tex nicely textured, nicely tex nicely textured hair all over the body, and the nicely textured scars. Textured, nicely sculpted teeth. Nostrils flared out. Heavy brow. Heavy gorilla, heavy gorilla brow. This, this King Kong. 
head is much more different than the 1933, than the classic 1933 King Kong head. It's now modern. It's all new. It's brand new and modern. And it vaguely resembles a baboon or a mandrill. See? Get a lot of that. And now for some size comparison. Bringing in. Now let's pop the head off right about now. And get the 1933, classic 1933, King Kong head back on. And here we have King Kong with his old, this classic King Kong head back on, as opposed to modern, as opposed to the modern, modern, as opposed to his modern day King Kong head. See? He has two open hands that come in a package and a modern roaring head and a, with a, and a modern roaring head that comes in the packaging. And now for some size comparison ring and I did not and did now for some size comparison bringing in Nekagargoyles, whoops, Nekagargoyles, Nekagargoyles Ultimate Goliath figure. There, there they are, side by side. See? Here we have King Kong next to next to Goliath with the wings spread out. And now let's compare this King Kong and now let's compare this King Kong figure from NECA with other with other Figures with other figures from NECA. And here we have this King Kong figure from NECA with the two NECA Predator figures. Like the unmasked, unmasked, unmasked Jungle Hunter Predator figure and the unmasked Scar Predator figure. There he is between the two Predator figures. Look at him now. Next to the two Predator figures. There he is between the... There, there is King Kong between the two NECA Predator figures. And now for some more size comparison. Bringing in... The two thousand and three, the the two thousand three, Godzilla two thousand three, from NECA, and Godzilla twenty nineteen from NECA. Here we have King Kong in between the two Godzilla figures from NECA. On the right is the twenty nineteen Godzilla. From the 2019 movie Godzilla, Godzilla King of the Monsters, directed by Michael Doherty. And on the left is the is Godzilla 2003, also known as SOS Goji, from Godzilla Tokyo SOS.
And last but not least, here we have. And last but not and last and last but not least. <laughs> and last but not least. Here we have King Kong next to the action attack Stegosaurus action figure from the Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom toy line. Nice and scale. They're both nice and scale. Just like, just like, just like in the magazine. See? Just like in the magazine. See? <sighs> and now for my final thoughts on this King Kong, NECA King Kong action figure. Why do I like it? Because I love it. It's a representation of the classic 1933 King Kong, but with a twist. The body hair is a reminiscent of the, is all, has all the different brown tones. Reminiscent of the monster vs. King Kong, as seen in Kong Skull Island, and Godzilla vs. and in, and Godzilla and Godzilla and, and Godzilla vs. Kong, but with battle scars. Remin remin reminiscent of the 2005 Peter Jackson King Kong from the 2005 film of the of the same name, and I love it very much. Well, that's all for today. Hit the like button by giving it, by giving it a thumbs up. And a comment down below. Thank you for watching my video, and I'll see and I'll see and I'll see you all again next time with another figure review. Goodbye.